Elsa? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yes. Can you say something? Hello guys, welcome back. Introduction first. Do me, let me do give me the honors, Abby. How do they say it? How do you always say it? Yes, let me let me do the I don't know. Let me shall do the introduction. Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Because it's almost like it's I have a nice channel now. So guys, it's a beautiful Saturday, it is sunny and cold winter Saturday this sunny eh? ah. I don't know it keeps yeah I think this is better yes guys so it's Saturday it's a long weekend being that Monday is also a public holiday it's the Louis Riel day I need to read up on what that is about so the point is that we're starting a vlog today and i'm going to be taking you guys on this vlog so if you're new here thank you for joining thank you for you know visiting this channel i'm sure you're going to like it here okay go and watch um the past videos and if you're a returning subscriber you know now we have special love between us you understand you know right okay so today is gonna be a fun day yes a fun day it's winter but i'm also trying to let you understand that there are activities you can do in winter yes so what are we doing today are you yes we're going swimming so one of the perks of where i work with is that i also get to enjoy some of the um some some things i get to enjoy some things so yes we're going swimming and apart from swimming i think there's also like an hot tub yes it's winter you also get to you know enjoy a hot tub and after swimming we're also going skating fingers crossed guys this one i'm scared but we can do it right can we do it yes we're all going skating including daddy and your fair <laughs> This one says she's not scared. When we get there, you will know, guys. You will know if she's scared. Later on, during the video, we'll see if you're scared or not, okay? None of us have skated before. Yes. We One thing we're sure of is that there will likely be a lot of falling down. What we're just going to do is that we're going to kit up real good, right? Have all of our kit on to keep us warm because it's still cold. I think it's about minus what now? minus 11 yes but feels like maybe minus 19 thereabouts but we're just gonna be ready enjoy winter before it ends so we have just like we've heard there's just there's just how many days to the end of winter i think we just have just about three or four weeks till winter ends we said let's do some winter activities right people have been saying ah Winnipeg, like there are a lot of winter activities for you to enjoy in Winnipeg. There is the tobogganing, the skating, hot sauna, all of these activities, right? So today we said, you know what? It's a long weekend. There's no work, no school on Monday. Let's enjoy something today. So guys, enjoy, okay? Make sure you like this. And subscribe and welcome back to our channel. Mm -hmm. Tell them to like it and subscribe. Watch this channel next time here when we are going swimming. Yes, she said you should watch it. So, guys, please, eh? Very importantly, don't forget to like this video, okay? Subscribe. Um, subscribe to Ayofe and Kemi. Eh? Which Ayofe and Kemi? <laughs> she said you should subscribe to Ayofe and Kemi's channel. Maybe we should even change the name of the channel too. Yes, the that's a good thing. Ayofe and Kemi way because no, I, I don't know. Ayofe and Kemi's channel. Okay. No, my name only. Yes. Not your other name. Not my other name. Yeah, it's just one name now. So guys, that's it. 
so enjoy this vlog with us with us okay and um see ya peace yeah. So we have arrived at the swimming venue. Mama, boy, I like you, Wally. So come here, come here, come here. Where are you going to? Uh uh. Do you know the? Do you know where you are going? Don't look. See this one. So guys, we have arrived. Uh, let's go swimming. Yeah. I'm more excited about the auto. I am very, very excited about the swimming. We'll see how it goes, guys. Back there we have a sauna and we have a hot tub. Those will be open all, pretty much all the time that the pool is open. But in the pool we do teach lessons and there are other classes. But uh, the rec swims and all the lessons and all the times will be up there. If you were interested in signing around for swimming lessons, yeah. the sign up date will be March okay. 20th at 12 o'clock. Okay. So you can do that online. The programs that run, like right now, is children's basketball. Uh, but it is also open for free gym if you ever just want to shoot around. Okay. All the schedules you can find online. Okay. Oh, Sierra Master, pretty much everything you can think of. And this is the e gym program. So this is included in your membership. It's a preset uh, workout circuit that you get a bracelet and you just pass it right here. And it will uh, automatically move to the preset uh, height and measurements. And it will take you through a workout. You just go through the circuit. I believe it's like. Oh, yes, it's something. Okay. Hello, guys. Welcome back while in the swimming place. Okay? And I'm dressed up in my swim costume. And now I'm going to swim in which right now. So we just finished. What did we just finish? We just got out the, of the hot tub, and the experience was. How was the experience, Ayefe? No, say it in your words. Those things you told me. How was it? How did you feel in the hot tub? She feels relaxed, guys. I've not gone into an hot tub before, but you see this one. I'm gonna be coming back. It was really nice. And I'm convincing my husband to, to come back because it was a beautiful experience. I've never been in an auto before. So first, when I got in, what's she saying now? The Bololo. Head southwest on Fermor Avenue, Route 135 West, or Dunkirk Drive, Route 62 North. Okay. So first, when we got in, it was so hot, like it was very hot. I was like, I eventually just go out. But then after a few minutes, half a few minutes, it was cool, guys. It was relaxing. Like they they had this um, these holes where water was coming out from. So they had this um, splodge, like water was gushing out of some like specific places where you could see 
it and around your leg that just it has this pressure that it's like you're doing a massage i don't know the expression because i've never entered it before i'm just exp i'm just explaining it the way it feels right yes i'm coming snacks yes after swimming you need snacks after hot tub you need snacks so guys it was a beautiful experience i love it it was one it's the first time and i just love the experience it was really fun it was relaxing like i even prefer this to being in a swimming pool the pressure i guess because of the pressure that comes out from the water and the everything i was relaxing guys i would if you've never been in, if you've been into an odd into an odd top before or yes odd top before let me know how did you feel do you feel the same way i'm speaking i'm feeling also because it was really good and then after of course as you can see my madam went into the play structure that was actually open today and she also had fun so we're on to the next guys come along with us please like this vlog guys oh you must like it yes said i hope you guys heard that subscribe so that you not miss one single video so that you meet and turn on your post notifications okay if you know yoruba you can you teach yoruba say one yoruba word let me hear you eh? Eba. beans Eba. No, that's not it. Say another one. All right, see you later, guys. Bye. Come now, come and take a picture. I want to hold the camera. Uh, if you hold it, how are we going to take the picture? You don't look at the camera. You that you not even see yourself. Okay, yeah. So guys, we're ready to where are you? We're ready to go skating. All dressed up. Come. All dressed up and ready to go skating. Are you ready to skate? Yeah! So guys, so far it's been so far so good, right? Yeah. We just packed. We want to pay now for the, we want to pay now for parking so that we can, you know, get started on the skating thing. So by the way, guys, we are at the Fox. If you live in Winnipeg, you've probably heard of the fox. Don't press anything. Don't press anything. Oh, God. So if you're in Winnipeg, you've probably heard of the fox. The fox has a children's museum. It has a zoo. It has so many things. It's like a tourist site in Winnipeg. Like the one of the biggest tourist sites. It has pancake house, a food place. So many. Name it. Whatever it is, it's all here. So... We're gonna try to see how much we can explore. That's if we are not tired from the skating because it's gonna be a long um, distance, skating distance. So, okay, hold on, it's skating ring. Souvenir stuff. <laughs> you want to warm up just come inside nice oops okay you want to look at me okay I will be without my rent. I'm on that. Okay, only only. 
Uh, yes. There was once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait A first time, a first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time, to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall
to have blown both phones. Yeah, for Are you there? Are you there? You don't tell it, Korea, you want to try. You don't tell it, Korea. The man is the one more techniques here to be easier for me. No, I think you have to try to balance on one leg at the time. Balance on one leg. You don't have to cry, you okay? You don't, you don't have to cry. You don't have to cry. You keep trying, okay? Until you get it, okay? You keep trying until you get it, alright? Do you want to try again? When you fall, you get up again, okay? Go and hold on to this thing. Go and hold on to that thing. <laughs> yeah? Hold on to it. Yeah, that's it. Gently, one after the other, okay? One at a time. Are you okay? Your leg has to stand straight. Straight, okay? Your leg has to stand straight. Straight. Now, one after the other, okay? One leg at a time. One leg at a time, okay? <laughs> Guys, I tried. <laughs> I tried. But the fear of me falling down is more it's bigger than me even trying it. Like I offer and I offer that they are even trying. They've gone, you know, they are there. But you see me, I can't even I'm scared, you know. I'm gonna get my husband to hold the phone now. And I'll try to get in there. Guys, don't laugh, okay? If you see me fall down. But I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna try. I've paid. We paid, we paid, we are here. We have to try it. We fall. I want to encourage myself the way I've been encouraging at your fair. We fall down, we rise up. So if you see me falling down, I'm just going to rise up like something happened. And we continue, okay? We knew.
Eating is a skill, like it's a life skill, especially. Well, I want to, guys, look at this boy. Look at this. Let me show you someone. So you see that guy that was able to, that young guy, boy that was, you know, doing it like it's no man's business. So, well, what I realized is because high hockey is like the official game here in Winnipeg and it's like a skill. So we just decided that, you know what, we'll sign a fair hub for skating. And for us with the uh, parents, um, I guess it's not for us. Or if there's something that makes it a lot easier, maybe like uh, wheels, like wheels or something. But you see, for me... No more skating. This is bye bye to skating for me. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of the vlog, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. You see, after all that falling down, we just looked around, right? We looked around the whole um, outside place and went into the um, very popular, the Fox Market, just to look around because people of God, that falling down was not easy. The way I was, and you know, at every point in time, I was hitting the ground. It was like, you know, there's this Yoruba word when they say, that is the, the pots, like, my let me just translate it let me try to make you understand like each time my butt was eating the ground it was it was it was terrible it was like a very <laughs> the pain was not here so we just headed into the fox market they had a lot of food place in here like you know maybe souvenirs we want to get some indigenous souvenirs and all of that you know that are linked or very common to winnipeg you could find them here so we just looked around and my dears we headed domo we couldn't even go to the children's museum we couldn't go anywhere else because guys after this cold and after falling down the only thing that could solve this matter was just to heat and go home so we headed for the door guys please don't forget to like this vlog all right like it like i mean like it subscribe turn on post notifications and you know drop your comment in the comment section let me know if you loved it okay and um see you guys bye